Hey everybody, I'm Senior Airman Corey Cutler with your look around the Air Force. Secretary of the Air Force Heather Wilson announced on Twitter that she's stepping down from the position after serving as the service's top civilian since May 2017 to accept the role as the president of the University of Texas at El Paso. Secretary Wilson said it's been a privilege to serve with Airmen and she's proud of the progress that's been made to restore the readiness and lethality of the force. Air Force Chief of Staff General David Goldfein responded to her post saying under Secretary Wilson's leadership, the Air Force became better. General Goldfein also said American Airmen will continue rowing hard, becoming even faster and smarter. He added that as she takes her talent and leadership to his home state of Texas, he wishes her the very best. Under Secretary Wilson, the total force increased 15% from 660,000 in 2017 to the 685,000 airmen we have today. She will continue to serve as the 24th Secretary of the Air Force until May. Air Force Chief of Staff General David Goldfein and Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force Khalith Wright spoke together about leadership at the Air Warfare Symposium in Orlando, Florida. During the speech, General Goldfein shared why diversity and inclusion are a warfighting imperative. Because the challenges we face as a nation are wicked hard. And it's going to take folks with different backgrounds, different life experiences, and different perspectives to be able to come in and sit down together and provide, provide the creative solutions that we as a nation need to be able to fight and win. You can hear the entire presentation from General Goldfein and Chief Wright on our YouTube page. Just go to youtube.com forward slash AFTV radio. Also, head over to AF.mil for the latest Air Force news and stories. And that's your look around the Air Force.